So today, I am going to my classroom to pick up some stuff. I have my sticky note with everything that I'm going to get. Um, yeah, it's going to be pretty interesting being in there. I mean, I know we've been gone for longer before with our breaks, but this just feels a little different. So, very quiet, knowing that children are supposed to be in there at this time. So, we'll see. <laughs> we don't know when we're going to go back so um just kind of looking at their desks and then like all of their work everything that we've done the whole year and everything that we had planned to do especially now towards the end of the year which is when we get to go outside without having to stay inside because it's too cold and stuff and just thinking of all of the science projects that we were going to do don't know when we will be able, able to go back hopefully soon i mean i don't know maybe we'll go back in a few weeks and we can still get to do all of those things but anyway pretty sad uh i picked up a few things and now i am going to upload all of the work uh, that they need to complete by Friday and um, the videos of me teaching um, the work that they need to complete so yep I just love my room <laughs> so just to finish off this video I wanted to explain what I plan on doing with each part of my remote classroom um, so let me just go ahead and explain obviamente this right here lo hice como un bulletin board i did like a bulletin board i already went ahead and i printed their week their first week's work and i put it on there that'll probably be up there for a while until um i don't want to go crazy with the printing uh but anyway i already went ahead and i sent out a picture to all of my parents that their work is up 
and I told them that I'm like super super proud of them so I went ahead and I got these for my classroom as you guys saw and also the little banners I also got those for my classroom uh, just because I wanted to make it look colorful I wanted to make my my students feel like we're still in school right here then I went ahead and I got this banner as well just to kind of decorate our whiteboard because if you guys have seen my classroom it's super <laughs> colorful and I do it just because I love uh, for my kids to feel happy when they're in there and it also helps me as well so um, just wanted to kind of recreate that stage for them um, and for me um, but this is where I'm going to be recording videos and teaching here possibly even doing zoom meetings with them here I have my little tripod that I can stand up and teach in that way using my phone and then here is our reward wall they all got uh, a trophy because they all really really tried their best the first week of remote teaching and I was super proud of them so I also went ahead and I, sh I shared a picture of that with each individual parent and I went ahead and I texted them, told them how grateful I was to have them as my parents and just, um, yeah, just thanked them for their flexibility and for not getting upset with me because I text them every 30 minutes and stuff. So my parents are super supportive. I love them. I love my children. Um, but yeah, so anyway, that's my remote classroom. Oh, no, I have forgot to show you where uh, everything else is. Anyway, just ignore that because this is a bedroom, it is also a gym, and it is also a classroom, okay? So anyway, this is where my little, I guess you could say office. <laughs> my office, I went ahead and I bought that at Target. It says, you are my sunshine. I love it just because I wanted to make my little place cozy um and easy to work with i have my padlet pulled up I'm, i am about to start working on this week's padlet so yeah this is basically where i will be doing all of my work i have a list there of my students just kind of check it off as i check in with them on a daily basis so that i can take attendance and then i went, go went ahead and i got this little cart for my classroom as well just so that i can kind of keep everything organized here and it's not all over the place in my classroom um i have my mr sketch scented markers these crayolas little scentsy stuff my vitamins um i have tape scissors markers and this is the little trophies down here i went ahead ahead and i organized my books these are my english books and these are my espanol libros and I kind of just separated them with this little fake plant because I cannot keep a plant alive to keep my life. To keep me alive? I don't know. Anyway, I'm terrible at keeping plants alive. Maybe once I have my own home, I'll be a little more into it. Pero sí, estos son los libros de español. Estos son los libros de inglés. Y acá abajo tengo diferentes materiales para crear recursos. Or, or activities, construction paper, glue sticks, crayons back there, the rest of that border, um, me, my laminating sheet. What? Papel, eh, my laminating sheet, my laminator, and my laminating sheets right here. So that is basically it. There it is. My clothes and my badge. But that's basically it. Mm -hmm.